there guys, it's Kim here from YourChicGeek.com. I want to welcome you to another fantabulous uh, video training, um, quick training on how to create animated GIFs using uh, Filmora Wondershare. Um, it's a mouthful, so I'll just say Filmora. Um, this is an awesome uh, uh, video editing tool that I use. It just makes it super easy peasy to create things like animated GIFs, to create videos that you can upload to YouTube, so on and so forth. So anyways, um, I am a techie and I do quite a few tutorials and I write a lot of content over here on my blog or on my website, Your Sheet Geek. And so um, one of the things that I do like to add to my content to spice it up that just kind of shows people a step-by-step -step guide or gives people like a little uh, animation to show them how to do certain things is I like to create animated GIFs of my recordings okay so in this video tutorial there's going to be a couple of tools that we're going to be using okay now I am using a for, for the video recording or the screen recording and capture of this actual training I am using a tool called Screencast-O-Matic it will only set you back 15 bucks a year and I think personally it is really a fantastic tool I'm gonna basically do another um, video tutorial somewhere down the line on that but this is the resource that I'm using to capture this video recording and then Wondershare Filmora is going to be the resource that I'm going to use to show you how to create an animated GIF okay that you can add to content and things like that and then I'm gonna show you how to add the animated GIF to content so for example, if I wanted to add an animated GIF on how to create a new page in WordPress, then the first thing that I need to do is to actually go and record myself creating the page in WordPress. And that's what I'm going to do right now. Okay. So I am logged into the back end of my WordPress website. WordPress is the resource that I use to power my site. And so what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to go over to the dashboard, right? Okay, and so under the WordPress menu here at the top, I'm going to go to new and then I'm going to go to page to create a new page, right? All right, so what I'm going to do next is give my page a title. So it'll be test adding a new page to create an animated GIF with Filmora. Okay. So the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to publish this page, okay? So that's essentially it. Now, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to pause the video for just a second because I need to basically export this video, okay? And then I'm going to export it and then come back and show you how to create the animated GIF using Wondershare Fillmore. So basically, again, step number one is to figure out what it is that you want to animate. So maybe if it's, you know, um, maybe if it's a video recording of yourself doing something, um, et cetera, and et cetera, you just need to figure out what you want to animate. And then number two is you need to use a video recording software to capture yourself doing what it is that you want to um, create the animated GIF for. So again, in this instance, I am creating an animated GIF of myself adding a new page in WordPress. Got it? So that's step number two. And then step number three is that we're going to export. I'm going to export this video and then I'm going to add it into Wondershare Filmora and then create the animated GIF of the video. So I'm going to show you how to create the animated GIF here in a second. So I'll be right back. Okay. Okay guys, so I am back with the second half of the video and in this video I am going to locate the video that I just recorded of me adding the test page in WordPress for the animated GIF. So I'm going to go ahead and look for this video. So here it is right here. So I'm going to go ahead and um, what I did is I'm using Windows 10 so I just did, you know, did a search down here in the search bar. You probably can't see this but I just typed the name of the video so it's adding a test page for animated GIF. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, locate this file. Okay, go to the file location. This is the name of the video. So what I'm going to do to make things easier is I'm going to drag this to the desktop of my computer so that it's easy to find. And guys, forgive me, don't, you know, look, my desktop is a hot mess and <laughs> I know I need to clean it up. But 
Anyway, let's move on. So now the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and open up my Wondershare Filmora app. Um, let me just take this from scratch just to show you guys what it looks like. Um, again here, I have this on my, um, on my computer. I'm just going to move the move this down here so you can kind of see what it looks like. I pinned it to my desktop. So I'm going to go ahead and click on this little icon here. This is for Wondershare Fil Filmora to open it up. And that's a mouthful, right? <laughs> so anyways, it's going to start coming up. This is the name of it. I just should just say film more, but it's going to start popping up the application. And um, what you want to do is once the application pops up is you want to go into full feature mode. This is going to give you access to all of the features, all of the... Um, <clears throat> All of the um, access to everything, you know, just to, to the colors, to the transit, to everything. So you want to go into full feature mode, okay? So next, after the application is opened up, I'm going to go to import, and then I'm going to click on import media file. So again, um, I have, I don't know why this is popping up, too much stuff. So let me do that again. So I'm going to go to import, import media files. And then I'm going to navigate to my desktop because that is where I shared or where I saved the video that I want to create the animated GIF for. Okay. And here is the video. So then I'm going to click open. Now, the last thing that you want to do is you want to drag the video that you want to create an animated GIF for to your timeline, which is down here. And so it makes it easy to do that. A couple of things that you can do. Number one is you can click this little red button here that says um, add to timeline. Okay, so as you can see, the video has been added to the timeline, or you can simply drag it. So I can hold on to this and then I can drag it. It's the same thing. Okay, so now this video is here on my timeline, as you can see, and it's open for editing. Okay. Now, another thing that I'm going to do, and it's something that I just like to do with um, the Filmora tool, is I'm going to go ahead and highlight this, and you can tell when it's highlighted because everything is going to be in red. And then I'm going to go ahead and click to crop and zoom because I kind of want to trim out some of the stuff at the top here. I don't really want it to show the search and all that. So I'm just going to crop that down and only show what needs to be shown. Okay. And then I'm going to click OK. And as you can see over here, it changed that. Now, the last thing that we're going to do is we're going to go to Export and we're going to create this animated GIF. OK, so I'm going to click on Export over here and you'll see the different file formats here. You'll see the WMV, which is this is a Windows movie, MP4, which is for video. This is a universal code, a codec. Or um, yeah, a universal um, codec or output that you want to use for every last one of your videos, okay? Because this is going to work with anything. So this is what you would want to use to export videos. You have AVI, you have movie, and all of this stuff. But what we want to do is click on GIF, okay? This is what we want to click on. So now what I'm going to do is under output descriptions, under the name, I'm just going to do how to create an animated... Oops. No, I'll just do animated gift. I'm sorry, animated gift of adding a new page in WordPress. Okay, all right, great. So with the settings, I'm gonna leave, yep, so the settings, I'm gonna leave all of this the same. I'm gonna click cancel, and this is a four minute and five second um, animation. And so um, I'm, I'm not gonna leave it that long, so if I wanted to cut this down instead of using the whole, you know, whole four minutes, what you can do in Filmora, and this is what I love, is because I only want to start this at the point where I actually show you how to create the animated GIF, right? So I'm just going to go ahead and scroll here. Okay, so you see what I did there? I'm dragging it all the way down. And so I'm going to scroll to the point where I know that I'm adding the new page in WordPress and then I'm going to go ahead and click the little split okay because I'm taking this part right here off and then I'm going to right click or just click on this and then I'm going to click delete and so you see what happened it took all of the extra and unnecessary stuff off because all I want to do is create the animated gif for the stuff that I'm showing somebody how to do right Okay, good. So the last thing that we want to do is, again, we're going to highlight the section that we want to use for the animated GIF. I'm going to click Export. 
And then I'm going to, again, make sure under format that the GIF section or the GIF selection is create or is selected. All right. And then I'm just going to do animated GIF for creating a new WordPress page, All right? So the resolution is the same. You can see the size went down because the file is not as big. The duration is one minute and 47 seconds, all right? So once I'm done and I have the information or I have the capture that I want to create the GIF for, then I'm just gonna click export, okay? So uh, Wondershare is gonna start creating this little movie or the GIF for what it is that I'm trying to show people how to do. And um, once it's done, then you know you'll 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 see it and you can kind of see how you can add the gif and I'm going to show you how to add the gif to your WordPress content and things like that but this is really a cool way to kind of again spice up your content maybe you want to create gifts that you can add to you know maybe your social media to do marketing um you know and all of that good stuff and so um And so this is going to be super duper helpful. So I'm going to go ahead and let this finish converting and then we'll be right back. Okay, so as you can see, the GIF is finished. Um, it's done. It's created. And so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on Find Target. And this is going to essentially just take me to the output, a.k.a. the animated GIF. Okay, so let's do this. And I'm going to go ahead and save this as a project so that I can refer back to it. Okay, I'm going to click save and that's going to be it. Okay, so after I clicked on the find target, you can see that this is the GIF file. It was created at 1212 at 137. So again, I'm going to take this, I'm going to drag this to the desktop. Okay, all right. So now let's double click on this to see what the animated GIF looks like. Oh crap, well, you know what? It's probably not going to work. That's okay. Let me do this. Let me go back to my WordPress website. So I'm going to log back in. And um, the page that we just created, let's see, animated. Okay, here it is. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and click on this page, guys, to just show you how to add the animated GIF and then what it can look or what it should look like, right, once, you're, once you've added it to your content. So what I would say is, for instance, if you wanted to create a new page or a new blog post or something like that, actually, let's just do new post. Yeah. So if I were creating a new blog post and I was creating a tutorial that I wanted to show people how to do certain things in the blog post. So I'll just do tutorial tutorial example with animated gif okay and then here is where you can do like you know your content animated gif content all right and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to click Add Media. I'm going to click Upload Files, Select Files. And from here, I'm going to go to my desktop because this is the GIF that I want to insert. Okay, so I'm going to click insert and this is the animated GIF. If GIF. So I'm going to click publish. Okay guys, so I'm going to go ahead and click update and then I'm going to click to view the post so I can just show you what the animated GIF looks like inside of your content. It's pretty cool actually. So as you can see, this is what it looks like. This is, as you can see, the name of the post. There's a little verbiage here, but this is the actual animated content 
that is, or the animated GIF that is showing people how to create a test page in WordPress. So it's just one way to dress up your content. And um, it's just a really neat way that I found and a neat feature that I found within the um, Filmora tool that you can get access to. Okay. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And, um, you know, I'd love to hear your comments about animated GIFs and if you're going to go out there and start creating them for your content. All right. Thank you so much for looking and viewing. And um, please, by all means, share this video with somebody that you think will find it helpful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys around. Okay. Thanks.